Comparing fractions using the number line. You know that the number line can be used to represent whole numbers, like 0, 1, 2, 3, and so on, as well as fractions. For example, 1 fourth is a fraction that represents one part of a whole. The whole is made up of four parts, the denominator, and it is shown by dividing the space between any two whole numbers into four equal parts. The numerator is one. So we are considering one part from the whole. On the number line, we represent one fourth by this point, as shown. Now, what if we were asked to compare two fractions using the number line? Let's do that by finding which of these is the larger fraction, 5 sixths or 2 thirds. For the first fraction, 5 sixths, at the bottom of the number line, we should divide the space between the whole numbers into six equal parts. And from zero, we begin counting to five. So this point represents five sixths. For the second fraction, two thirds, at the top of the number line, we should divide the space between the whole numbers into three equal parts. And from zero, we begin counting to two. To get this point that represents two thirds. Look at the number line carefully. What do you see? Notice that both fractions are located at different points, so they are not equal. And the length, which is represented by the fraction 5 6, is more than that represented by the fraction 2 thirds. And this shows that the fraction located further to the right has the largest value. So, 5 6 is greater than 2 thirds. In this lesson, you learned how to compare fractions using the number line.